but seeing the score i did not expect i was targeting for 99.9 but uh, when the exam was over i was little bit so we were not very happy at that time that he had a good score in 2024 and he could have got into a good college but and this year the exams have become a little bit more harder compared to last year so it's more of concept than the formula and കാക്കനാടിലെ ട്രിനിറ്റി വേൾഡിലെ ഇഷാൻ വിനോദിൻ്റെ വീട്ടിലാണ് രണ്ടായിരത്തി ഇരുപത്തിയഞ്ച് ജെയ് മെയിൻസ് സെക്ഷൻ വണ്ണിൽ നയൻറ്റി നയൻ പോയിൻറ്റ് എയ്റ്റ് സീറോ പെർസെൻറ്റേജ് സ്കോറോടുകൂടി ഉന്നത വിജയം കരസ്ഥമാക്കിയ ബ്രില്യൻ പാലായിലെ വിദ്യാർത്ഥിയാണ് ഇഷാൻ വിനോദ് ഇഷാൻ വിനോദിൻ്റെ കുടുംബവും ഇപ്പോൾ നമ്മളോടൊപ്പം ഉണ്ട് ഹലോ ഇഷാൻ വെൽക്കം സോ ഐ ഇഷാൻ വിനോദ് ഐ സ്റ്റഡീഡ് ഇൻ ബ്രില്യൻറ്റ് റിപ്പീറ്റേഴ്സ് ബാച്ച് ആൻഡ് ഓൾസോ ഐ സ്റ്റഡീഡ് ഇൻ ബ്രില്യൻറ്റ് ഇൻ ലെവൻത്ത് ആൻഡ് ട്വൽത്ത് ഇൻ ദ ലോങ് ടേം ബാച്ച് ഇറ്റ് വാസ് എൻ ഓഫ്ലൈൻ ബാച്ച് ഇൻ തേവര and then i joined the repeaters online batch and uh, srimon miss was my class teacher in the online batch and i studied in uh, cbse school rajagiri in plus 1 and plus 2 and here is my father and my mother father's name is vinod navin and he is an associate professor and mother sunita vinod she is a housewife okay hishan how was your experience while when you scored the 99.80 percentile score and what and what was the reaction of your family members your friends your cousins and even though your classmates my family members my mother and father were happy and even i was happy because of the percentile last year i secured 98.8 and in the first session i secured 95.5 last year so i was very happy that i got 99.8 this year and did you expect that Uh, but seeing the score i did not expect i was targeting for 99.9 but uh, when the exam was over i was little bit uh, not thinking i'll get this much score i expected 99.1 or 2 so sir how was your experience while seeing his victory so as uh, ishan mentioned he appeared for je in 2024 and uh, he himself uh, requested that he gives one more attempt okay. in 2025 so the, the initiative came from his side so we were not very happy at that time that he had a good score okay. in 2024 and he could have got into a good college but uh, so considering that when the result came 99.80 it was uh, we were very very happy yeah yeah very very happy because we didn't expect this much though he really he is a really hard working and dedicated by himself we don't have to force so that's a boon <laughs> so hishan uh, how was the facilities that provided by the billion for your courses um i was using the brilliant classes app as well as the e learning app e learning app okay. huh. and in the classes app we had the classes and also regular doubt session okay. and uh, then the exams were the weekly basis weekly test also model exams and also they conducted single chapter exams at sometimes and then during november or december they had started their test series okay each uh, unit wise there were i think eight units mm-hmm. and uh, the chapters were split physics chemistry maths eight units and um, there was test for jee main okay did you attended any offline exams offline no so you attended all the exams yes, online so online and how was the doubt clearance facility of the learning app that is good when okay. we send out we get okay and what about your uh, class teacher of your uh, repeating class teacher was sri mon miss she was okay. very cooperative she used to call mm-hmm. once in 3 weeks or once okay. in a while she used to call me and also ask how is your performance and also to improve better so can you share your experience about the tevara center ha huh. the tevara center it was good and um, that time anish kv sir was our coordinator and my class teacher was amal sir and um it, it was a big class like 100 students were there and uh, it used to be on every sunday and on special holidays 
So while uh, doing the long time course, uh, did you attempted any of the JEE exams? Yes, I attempted all the exams like weekly tests and okay. model exams last year. And what about the JEE mains? Huh, I had attempted it, uh, but uh, because there were school board exams okay. also. I and what was your score during that time? Uh, the first session I got 95.5 percent. So after when you completed the long time and you attended the exam, you scored 95 point. Okay. Yes. And now you have scored 99 point. It's yes. okay. So uh, the online classes are better good, right? Not like that. Offline also was good, okay. but I couldn't manage with the school properly. Okay. That is why. Oh, so um, that I couldn't uh, cope up that much with okay. school because there was a lot of assignments and everything from school, and I also wanted to get a good percent percentage okay. in my board exam. Okay. So did you feel any stress while uh, doing at the same time at the long time as well as the school board exam? No, no. I really enjoyed it. It was okay. nice experience. So did the long time classes helped you in your board exam in mainly in physics, chemistry, and mathematics? Yes, definitely it helped, and there were many questions. which were taught in the class like hard hard questions they okay. came in board exams also. okay so the long time also was a you very helpful definitely right? okay so later any of your friends uh, is there who studied in brilliant yes uh, many are there and uh, many were in my long term batch uh, but they decided to repeat offline in pala okay pala is yes. okay and you choose the online online classes. Classes. and the e learning app was such good it is good okay yeah. even though all of the study materials and what about the study materials study materials also good like uh, the advanced material especially i liked it there are two uh, books unit 1 and unit 2 in that they are separated into six units mm. and the question collection are good mm. especially maths and all and are you trying for the uh, je section 2 uh, i am mainly focusing on advanced, advanced as okay. well as on je section so uh, while uh, clearing the je advanced what is your aim uh, what is your ambition to which college to join I will try to get into IIT Madras. IIT, IIT Madras. Ah, or any and, of the top sir. And we are focusing on which course in IIT Madras? Um, either electronics or mechanical. Okay. And did you start your preparation for the JE Advanced? Yes, I started. Okay. I am attending the exam, unit exams. Okay. Every week. Okay. And still now you are uh, focusing on the learning app, and you are studying all of the uh, classes from that. Yes. Okay. And how is the online classes? It is good and okay. regular doubt session. Just before the exam, unit wise okay. exam, they conduct weekly doubt session and weekly okay. exam. So, did you stay in any of the hostels in Pala? Yes, uh, last year after my board exam, I went to hostel for almost one month in April, May, between that, and uh, I stayed in Pala House hostel. Okay. And uh, seeing the environment of the hostel, it was very nice, and the students always were studying, okay. and the teachers also like Kishore sir and all used to come and clear doubts yeah. in the hostel. seeing their efforts and i also felt to repeat so you were there in the pala house for one month one month okay yes. and it was a very good atmosphere to study yes okay. definitely otherwise i was not going to repeat but seeing okay. their effort and the way they are studying i also thought i'll try once more okay then can you tell us about your study plan as well as your uh, that systematic plan uh, i don't have that much plan last year i used to keep a plan but this year i do each chapter i spend at least like two days i practice all the Uh, J main previous year question first. Then I try to do the J advanced previous year question. Then our module mm -hmm. and the unit wise test. So usually a day, how much hours did you focus on studies? Uh, like that, I don't keep a count. Uh, approximately maybe five hours. Five hours. Mm -hmm. Okay. And which subject you are uh, more focusing? Physics, chemistry, or math? Math. Math. Oh. Okay. And how is math for you? Is it tough or? No, uh, for me now it has become easier. Okay. Easier. Okay. Class. What about physics and chemistry? Physics is a little weak, but okay. chemistry is also good. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. So, Ishan, what is your advice for the students who are going to appear for the JEE Section Two? Uh, my advice would be uh, now just a few more days are there or two okay. three more weeks. Mm -hmm. So, better is that they revise all the formulas. Mm -hmm. And this year the exams have become a little bit more harder compared to last year. So, it's more of concept than the formula. And um, mainly focus on physics, chemistry also. And even if we do a few questions in maths, we'll get a good percentile in maths. Okay. Try not to get any negative. Okay. Mm -hmm. So is there any area for uh, that you have to focus more on that? Uh, like uh, physics, uh, there are a few chapters. Okay. Ha, huh, like rotational motion or uh, electrostatics okay. and uh, ray optics. There are many questions are asked this year. Usually, last year's exams, one one question used to come from each chapter. Mm -hmm. But this year, I noticed that in my shift itself, from a single chapter of optics, there were three questions. Mm. So we have to focus okay. on each chapter. Okay, sir, uh, can you share your experience when you visited the uh, Brilliant Studies Center and about the faculties as well as the all of the members of the Brilliant Studies Center? 
so brilliant uh, if you see i think is the biggest coaching center in kerala yes. and we were able to see the uh, scale of brilliant operation when we went uh, for the victory yes victory day. victory day celebration okay. we could see the scale of brilliant yes. operations yes. you know it's one of the uh, not one it's the biggest uh, coaching center uh, and uh, there's a lot of effort put in by the teachers and the center the administrative department as well as the training department is putting a lot of effort to coach the students who are coming to brilliant uh, we could see that you know and they are very cooperative uh, whenever they have a uh, interaction with the teachers they are very cooperative they used to give us uh, good feedback about ishan and that helped us to come back home and tell him what he needs to correct so they gave a good feedback um and seeing the center in pala and the facilities uh, i think there's a lot of effort put in by the administration of uh, brilliant uh, only thing is uh, the students have to put in effort you know if you see all over india um, we from the state of kerala has to has uh, got good scope to improve in all india scale and i think brilliant has taking a lot of effort but the students have to put in their efforts and if that effort can come in then i think lot of students from kerala will get good seats in good colleges in india so ishan how was your experience while undergoing a tight competition between students it was little nervous i was little nervous but i was also optimistic and i was confident that i will get it because i okay. prepared well yes. and i put the hard work and did you feel any time demotivated No, no no i kept on doing yes okay you you maintained your motivation yes are you self motivating yes sir. okay So, ma'am, how was your experience when you visited the Brilliant Studies Center, Pala? Uh, it was really good. Actually, we were a uh, little tense that uh, how the food uh, facility and all will be because and first time he is staying away from us. But then uh, first day itself, uh, next day when I called, he was really happy, and the food provided was really good because we were we are veg and we were little consider. I mean, we were little uh, tense, but he was really happy whole month. He was really happy and he didn't want to come back. Uh, we, we thought within two days he'll come back, okay. thinking of the food. But okay. uh, he didn't want to come back and he hardly used to call us. So he really <laughs> enjoyed that. He enjoyed. Right. He enjoyed. Okay. <laughs> and uh, uh, if the students really work hard mm. and uh, with regular prayers, mm. uh, they will. They can really score okay. with full determination. Mm. Yes. They can really score well. So Ishan, how was your scores? Mm. That is. Uh, which was your highest score and which was your lowest score while you were attending the unit test as well as the model exams in the unit test for jee mains i used to it is out of 300 yes. 100 per subject and i used to score uh, in between 150 and 230 or 240 in the unit test because the unit test is little more harder than the original exams they keep so it will be good for us when we attend the real original exam it will be easier that time ipol okay. nammala ketade jee mains 2025 unnada vijayam karasthamaakiya ishan vinodinte എക്സ്പീരിയൻസ് ആണ് നയൻറ്റി നയൻ പോയിൻറ്റ് എയ്റ്റ് സീറോ പെർസെൻറ്റേജ് സ്കോറോട് കൂടിയാണ് ഇഷാൻ ഈ ഒരു ജയ് മെയിൻസ് ക്ലിയർ ചെയ്തിരിക്കുന്നത് ജയ് അഡ്വാൻസ് ആണ് ഇനി അടുത്ത സ്വപ്നം എന്ന് പറയുന്നത് അപ്പോൾ ഇഷാന് ജയ് അഡ്വാൻസ് എന്ന് പറയുന്ന ആ ഒരു സ്വപ്നം അത് എത്രയും പെട്ടെന്ന് കൈവരിക്കാൻ സാധിക്കട്ടെ എന്ന് ആശംസിക്കുന്നു സോ ഇഷാൻ താങ്ക് യു താങ്ക് യു സാർ താങ്ക് യു Brilliant Study Center India's number 1 coaching center for NEET and JEE